everybody, Thy Lord Roots here, and today we have returned to another episode of Let's Play Martian Dreams. So, uh, we actually ended up searching a couple of caves here. There was something I didn't want to get in here while we're at it, because I think it would be good for us to have the shovel here, just in case we need it. Uh, that's the wheelbarrow, I guess... This here is the shovel. Somewhere around here, the shovel can be found. Right here. We'll just move that to our toolkit. And it turns out that, um, well, two things. You'll notice that I'm moving a lot faster. That's because I upgraded the cycle limit here to uh, something to the order of twice of what it was running at before. And so, um, that's good to know. But clearly, Cooter isn't in any of these caves. And he's gotta be somewhere around here. So we need to go looking for him. What we do know is that there is a marker around here and there may be other things around here as well we'll just get away from this bush rat here I think maybe doing some exploring wouldn't be out of the question Even though I'm fairly certain that we are not quite where we want to be. Let's try to get oriented real quickly because I believe around here is Cooter's Cave. We'll see. So this is Cooter's Cave. We've already been here. Hopefully that is the only bush rat we will have to kill. Interesting, I guess I accidentally disabled combat mode. So somewhere around here, there is another cave. And we will definitely need to be careful here because that, um, we could very easily lose ourselves here. This maybe be it, or this, I bet it's Cooter's Cave again. We definitely need to stop getting turned around here. So we'll just do this in a methodical sort of way. Now up here, is the cave entrance. Maybe around here. Let's use our spyglass and see if maybe we can find anything which would be... There's definitely something down there. whatever it is. What I may do is if I don't make much headway on searching for this cave let's just see if maybe we 
we're, I think, yeah, that marker's over there, so we want to go the other way. There's Nelly Boy out of ammo. She needs to be in attack mode. She's going to do that, although... We'll just assume that that did the trick there. If it takes too long, I will go ahead and search for this on my own and come back, because it occurs to me that this is something that could be very boring. Maybe if we go down here. There are buildings of some kind over there. It looks like... The Hedgehog has been vanquished. We'll just come up here. Maybe if we go around. Then that will give us some kind of idea. Because as it stands, I have no idea how to navigate these caverns. But what I do know is that, um, So that, I bet, if we look up, we will find... Maybe close to here. Oh wow, I made the air squid disappear. Could that be it? Something tells me that that is too simple. And that this is where we came from. Well, let's at least rest. No leveling up this time. You know, I think that may be the entrance to a new cavern. We have no way in. So we will, um, we'll get over there somehow, I think. There appears to be a lovely little entrance here. Somewhere over here. If uh, we happen to be able to find the sky. Yeah, this is the. This is the other guy here. It's not such a good 
thing to happen. We're gonna go around the top. I mean, I guess at least we got this straightened out just a little bit. Not, we'll just, um, you know, we'll leave and come back. Whoa! What are those? nice if we had ammunition. I guess we could technically afford it. So that's Coprate Chasma there. And we are now back to the point of needing to go around and maybe seeing if we can find anything. I'll bet you these are cacti we're about to run into. And I really do not want to run into cacti. That would be quite bad if we did. However, um, this looks like a good place to start looking. If we look at these plateaus... Then maybe it'll... Um, may we'll be in the right place. If not... Then I think... Maybe we ought to... Find Cooter instead. Or not Cooter, but... I guess, uh, Sherman... And Yellen and all those people. Unfortunately, um, you know, given the landscape, it's difficult to tell. I think we're, we're in a promising place, I'll put it that way. Too many moving trees. It's rather unfortunate, actually, it's so... Um, we're 12 South 60 West.
something to the southeast. I really cannot be bothered to go southeast right now. Oh great, the, the Cactus of Doom. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and get the signatures. Cooter is just going to have to wait. Given his ineptitude. Meanwhile, we want to go to 10 North... 71 East? Something like that. I believe, in fact, this area over here may have something to do with the... Three north, twenty-three west. If there is a... whoa! crazy robot that has attacked us. Where is this? This is rather interesting. I believe we're in some kind of power plant. We've met a robot that is also a train. I think that's awesome. You can't really beat robotic trains. Let us see what his job is. So, there is... Hole. He puts it on a conveyor belt. Is he perhaps um, for a power plant? Maybe. Or there's a character called Stoker. Who appears to be more or less okay. This is his counterpart, Stoker. So this is a power plant, it would seem. Um, yeah, definitely... Not a bad deal for us. But, um... There are towers. Let's see. So we need to look for a guy named Trippet. Once we turn on that, we should get access to a number of things that we might not have access to otherwise. Kind of a bit of a problem, though. We need to get Sherman's signatures.
in order to get access to Olympus. Well, that is rather unfortunate. You know what, I'm gonna grab that conveyor belt and see if I can't find them. Because I think it's about high time we took care of that. It's night and we need to maybe consider going to bed. There we go. So we at least know about that. I think we'll move this guy to our spectacular bag of holding here. We do know that there happen to be berries here that maybe we should get at the risk of maybe irritating another agrobot. So I need to more or less go south until I find a bridge. Really a bridge of any kind would be good to find here. still can. Well, there is a bend here, so maybe... Or maybe not. There's a wall here. And one moment. Okay, we are back. And there's this dude. He has issues with um, insecurity, it looks like. So this is Rasputin's territory. What is he talking about? <laughs> I think I'm somewhere where I don't need to be. I guess this game must have been a little bit rushed. I haven't blown down anybody's wall yet. If I inadvertently... Um... Create a sequence break... I'd better leave that dude alone. There's no telling what kind of damage I've done. Just by talking to him. But we're at least on the other side of this canal here. And 
that's a good place to start. Yeah, you know, usually in Ultima games, you don't run into that sort of, um, that sort of deal. Okay, what is to the north here? Something is going to kill us. If we can really just move over here, you know, I think we'll be gravy. Oh, these guys. Maybe, given that they have a body, a body. Or I guess not. The fact that they have a body has no bearing on this situation. I'm gonna get out of here because, um... Let's take a look at the sextant. The sextant shall reveal all. Or something like that. Well, more, more of these guys. Machete has made pretty quick work of these guys. We'll just uh, leave these dudes hanging for now. Oh, nice, there's Oxium here. I don't mind if I do. Let's see. We'll just... Continue to, to pick the sky up. Maybe by doing this. Ooh. Oh no, they took my oxygen. I've read about these guys. They are kind of like the gremlins 
and all in Ultima 6, except instead of stealing your food, they steal your oxio. I am now in great need of. I suppose I don't. I'll maybe get away without it. Something tells me perhaps I'm not going the right way. Spectre does, however, need sleep. That's going to be a bit of a problem. Let's just figure out where we are. Good news is we're pretty close. And there are those purple berries which we need so much. Tons of them, in fact. Just gotta get him in the right place. And here we, of course, have tremendous amounts of lag. Now we found somebody. We've got a little bit of a puzzle to do here. Now this guy is yelling. things here that we could use. We'll get this base out here first. Probably a better sleep, real quick. 
you know, since we're here and everything. Uh, let's see. We'll put a point into dexterity. And we'll give Nelly Y a little bit more strength. We'll give Dibs a little bit more strength, too. Dupre. It looks like Dupre, anyhow. Apparently involved in the American Indian Wars. This is Richard Sherman. Let's see what he has to say about expeditions here. which would actually be quite nice for us to have. He also has um, a book. He has Dante's um, Inferno, it looks like. A 
we should talk to Yellen real quick. And that's actually not a bad place for us to be right now. I may just simply go ahead and make my way out to, um, well, let's make our way out to maybe one of the cities here. Maybe we need to go back to Elysium. If we can. Because I don't think there's going to be much for us. If we just use our spyglass here to look east. Seems rather desolate to me. I'll just leave Dupre and the Yellen to eating their magical purple berries. And I believe I will maybe try to get to Olympus. Hoping by this point that I haven't broken the game. The, uh, the likelihood of that seems relatively high to me. But you know, you never can tell. Let's see what level everybody's at. Sherman is level two. Interesting. Well, he won't be for long. I believe at this point our party is actually axed out. And we just need to get back as soon as we can. Taking care, of course, not to um, get ourselves trapped too far here. I think maybe one of the things we can do here, once we get to the bottom, is we might look at, oh, um, oh yeah, we ran out of fuel. The barge there, though. Barge with a cannon on it, in fact. And we 
you're at least back over here. I guess the crazy dude is gone for now. We just have to uh, get back to Olympus, find Captain Trippet. I think maybe I will look at a map when we are done here. And maybe explore the caverns a little bit more. No, don't do that. Something to the west. that out, I don't think. But I will pitch a tent real quick because unless of course something is following us. This is not a good place to be. We should use our tent. We will rest until sunrise. And hopefully get back really soon. That seems to be our next priority. Cooter may be a good person to rescue first, though. I'm pretty sure Cooter has to be somewhere around where we're at. south. I think we have gone far beyond where we need to go to. Getting the power on would definitely be nice at this point, because I keep on getting myself lost, and I do not believe we want to do this. The 
least not for too long. It may be easier just for me to die. I think we are pretty close to where we want to be, though. If I recall correctly, this is about where the cacti are. get out of here. I think uh, we definitely need to get into town. So this is, of course, about Elysium, which we've heard about that has all of the crazy people in it. But we'll, we'll get in. We are welcome here, at least for the time being. This man will be our crying soldier. I think he's a soldier. So we have other things to look for. He is in the Olympus Mines. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. Except, here's Edison. And I do want to do one thing before we leave. Ask him about Tesla. As I thought he, um, he does not like Tesla at all. Well, we will, for now, just leave that as it is and figure out where to go from here. I'm thinking we might want to either get the belt repaired or we may be interested in possibly doing other things, like rescuing Cooter. I think we could really do both. 
But until then, this has been Thy Lord Root, and I will see you later.